What's up guys, Quantrix02 here with another edition of What's New. And last night on Monday Night Raw, at the at the uh, end of Monday Night Raw, when The Rock came out to do a celebration after, one, after retaining the WWE Championship at the Elimination Chamber, he revealed to us a brand new WWE Championship. Yes, after nearly a decade, the spinner belt is gone. The spinner belt is over. That era is done. We have a brand new belt. And by now, you've probably seen it. Now, uh, I was going to make this video yesterday, but I felt like I was, I was like, I didn't really like the design of the belt, so I, I felt like I was going to bury it. Now there's some good, now that I've, uh, you know, had a day to sink it in, I have my pros and my cons about this championship and, and the design of it. Apparently, I read an article today on uh, WWE.com that the uh, WWE actually got help, actually, um, the design was somewhat created by uh, American Choppers. Um, the the uh, motorcycle um, the motorcycle customizer people from uh, the TV show so they kind of helped design the championship and they wanted to do something different that was never done now I, I respect that fact that they actually tried to you know do something different than you know uh, than they've done previously with the championships most of the WWE championships in the past have had eagles globes um, all these kind of things and every single one of them have, have had this um, have, have either one or, one or two of those uh, things in there and WWE wanted to do something completely different that no other company has done and they actually did that now the cons of the title is that it's it just seems too basic it's too it's just a basically just a it's shaped like the United States Championship it has a giant WWE uh, logo in it and uh, champion now what I don't like what they're doing is it seems like they're getting away from the nameplates which I really I love that the name when they actually started bringing putting the nameplates on titles it makes it feel like it's more of a um it's that person championship when you see your name down there that's what I really liked about the previous championships now it seems like they're getting away from that you know the first was the Intercontinental Championship that no longer has a nameplate now the new WWE Championship does have a nameplate so uh, it's a big plate, like I said, it's a big plate, it says champion at the bottom, and it has the two side plates. Instead of four, it's just two giant side plates, which I believe those are going to be customizable because on the Rocks version of it, they have the uh, the Brahma Bull logos in there. We're just going to be able to customize those out, depending on the champion. Say John Cena um, wins it, he's probably going to have the You Can't See Me sign, or you know, if Kobe Kingston won, he'd have the, the Boom Man uh, sign, or... Uh, you know any kind of logo <clears throat> I'm probably gonna have on the side plates but the one that you can buy now off of uh, WWE.com WWEshop.com uh, which is like five, it's like five hundred dollars by the way um, has a WWE logo with the um, with the uh, what is it the continents inside of that which it looks actually that that version looks better than the Brock's one because Rocks one is you just it's the bulls and you see through it. That's another thing. Like um, on the main plate, there's nothing under it. Like a lot, a lot I know a lot of people. Like I've watched TV Breach video and he said he doesn't like the fact that uh, you know they throw so much gold in there, but it just looks so like like it's incomplete without like there's the main plate and beneath it there's nothing. There's no gold or anything. It's just you see the bare. You just see the strap right through it, which is different. Which I, once again I respect that, but I don't really like that. Uh, that much it just makes it feel like it's just some kind of you know a toy not say that the spinner belt was better but yes I really do believe that it was time for the spinner belt to go it's been here it's overstayed it's welcome way too long we have a new belt it's not the greatest belt but there's some pluses it's original it's probably the most original belt WWE has ever made but uh just the 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 fact that it doesn't have anything behind the actual main plate makes it look weird and there's no uh, name plate anymore which is kind of a bummer and it's kind of shaped like the United States Championship but other than that it I can say you know WB um, good job with that I guess good job with trying to become be original I just wish it looked a little bit better but I'm pretty sure, like uh, like we did the spinner belt, we'll get everybody to get used to it and you know accept it for what it is. And yeah, 
But that's all, guys. What did tell me uh, below? What do you like the new belt, or do you, do you want me to make it like the spinner, or um, do you, are you fine with what we've got right now? Let me know, guys. Comment, rate, subscribe. Stay go, peace.